Hi guys, welcome to Fitness Circle uh, Tuesday. Andy and I are here and you're seeing Tumeshika Vijiti. We come in peace, all right? We are at Utawala Gym and Aerobics and we want to take you guys through a sticks workout. This is literally a broomstick, so go and come and join us and let's have a beautiful sticks workout. We'll start by warming up, hold the edges of the stick and then go till your end and come back. So that's one. So your job is to go all the way back and go down and go all the way. That's three. And go down. Be intentional about warming up. Four. Let's go. Five. Let's go. Six. Four more. Seven. Eight. Give me two more. Nine. Keep breathing at all times. Give me one more. And ten. Hold it narrow or shoulder length. And we're just going to do a shoulder press. Five, four, three, two, go. One, go two, go three, go four. What we are warming here is our shoulders. Five, and we are also opening up the chest with the first workout. That's what we did. Six, seven, eight, nine. Give me one more. And 10. Now hold it at the back. All right, so I'll turn and face these guys. So your job is to go as far high up as you can and take it back. Three, two, go one. Perfect. Two, and three, and four, and five. This is working our upper back. Six, and still getting those shoulders. Seven, opening up the chest as well. Eight, give me two more. Nine, give me one more. And 10, give me. 10, now take it, hold it wide. This is what we are doing next. We go all the way down and go all the way up. So it's kind of a deadlift, don't give me a squat. And then from there, Andy is going to take us through the first workout. Five, four, three, two, give me that deadlift and go all the way up. And that's one. And that's two, we have eight more. And that's three, seven more. Four, six more. Five, make sure your chest is flat back. I see our middle guy, he's taking it slow. But he's doing very well. I lost count, so I'll assume we have one last one to go. Andy, get ready. And we move. Okay. Ready to go? Why does it sound like it's a threat? <laughs> All right. Okay. 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 Next. Let's go. 50. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, you know, I thought you were playing with that 50. I thought he was playing with that 50 count. All right. So I'm going to challenge our core strength and our balance. So we have this and our hand out and our leg up. So what you're doing is go down and up. So when you go up, the same leg that goes up is the same leg that you push up. Five, 10 counts, four, three, push that leg back and go up. One, go, two, go, three, go, four, go, five. This is getting these other legs. Six, quad, seven, eight, nine, <laughs> one more, ten. Why are you coming here? Close that to you. <laughs> Where is he going? <laughs> the weight. <laughs> All right. So that's really good. He's okay. telling you there's a lot of core engagement. And he's really getting the calves, right? So let's do the other side. Hand out or drop it, whatever you're comfortable. Five, four, three, two, move the leg back and go. One, go. Two, go. Three, go. Forgive Andy. Five, go. Six, go. Seven, go. Eight, two more. 
One more? Ten. <laughs> you have to redeem yourself. Balance. Balance. Balance is. Is of importance. Okay, we're going back to the jacks. Okay. All right. How many do you want? Bring the weight up. Now this time it comes down, goes up. Okay. 50. Three, All right. Two. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Give me ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right. It is, it is me moving. <laughs> but you see, I'm trying to be in support of, of his earlier movement. Let's put our sticks down. Okay. In front of us. So, a lot of sticks workouts are a lot of cardio. Sawa sawa. But you can still do it um, as a strength training. Yeah. But you'll have to put in more effort because the stick is really, really, really light, all right? Yeah. So we're doing a sprint, and then when I say jump, you jump forward, so I'll demonstrate. So it's sprint, when I say jump, forward, back. Get back to sprinting, all right? All we right. do 10 counts, we jump at my count. Five, four, three, two, sprint. Jump, go, jump, 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 jump. Jump. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. All right. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you said, ah, okay. It's such a simple equipment, but it can really be used for whatever it is you want while you're working out. Next. Good. Lower body. Okay. Now, most of the lunches that we do at the gym sometimes, we use a weight, a yes. barbell, yeah. and there's a weight here. Yeah. There's a way you can also do static lunches using the stick. Yes. But you have to ensure that you lunge. Make sure that leg is far away from you. Yeah. Don't lean forward. Chest has to be out. Yeah. I want you to take it down slowly and up. Down slowly and up. Okay? Okay. Don't lean forward. Three, two. Let's go one. Up. Two. Up. Three, four, five. Guys, this is called a stationary six, lunge because we are seven, not moving. Eight, nine, and ten. Good. Place it down and you come the other side. Remember, whatever you do on the other side of your body, you have to do it on the other side also. Okay, three, two, let's go down. One. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's sit down. Our sticks are still on the ground. I want us to do some half burpees. So if it's half burpees and your sticks are here, bring them close to your legs or your feet and your forward or rather your upper body is forward yeah. so this is what we are doing when i say half bappy i mean it's literally a half bappy or a half tuck plank it has so many ways you can call it but we won't go up to complete the bappy so we are here all we are doing is jumping in jumping out okay? okay we are doing 10 counts but we are controlling don't do it too fast because also when you step on the stick it can be hazardous you slide your way all over this gym are we ready five i like your posture nice Five, four, three, two, let's go in, out. One, go. Two, go. Three, go. Four, go. Five, go. Six, go. Seven, go. Eight, go. Nine, one more. And ten. Good. All right. That weight is still down. Okay. Okay. So you're going to face this direction. Okay. Face me. I face you. Right. Good. So these are simple. Same close. direction? 
<laughs> well, pick a side. Whatever you want to face. Pick a side. <laughs> okay. Whatever you want to face, okay? Mm -hmm. So this is simple. You just jump in one. Okay. You jump out two. Okay? All right. Three. Now you make sure you pick it from down. Bend. Three, two, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Give it ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Let's pick up. <laughs> Let's pick up our equipment. I feel like Stanley and Nanjal are really having a good time with this. Yeah, they're enjoying. So they're, so we should just continue. Yeah. I want us to do some core. So we hold the edges of the stick and we try to reach the farthest point of our leg, which should be the foot, all right? Okay. So I'll demonstrate for one, go. So your job is to try and not curl too much yeah. because it's literally like doing, uh, what is it called? A lying down, single leg, but opposite side, sort of yeah. long, long crunch or something like that. It's a core workout. Five, four, three. Let's start with this side. So this is how we are starting, like that. Five, four, three, two. We are alternating and go. Alternate to the other side. One. Let's go. Alternate. Two. There we go, guys. Alternate. Three. Go. Remember, if you have tight hamstrings, four. You might feel some pull in your hamstrings, and we keep saying the hamstring is the back part of your upper limb, and that's the legs, all right? So the back part, we are at, I think, seven. So if you feel some really pull and strain, just take it down and use the knees because you don't want to get a muscle pull, and you're really trying to work that core. But for me, I have really nice and beautiful hamstrings, so I'll get back to this. Give me last one. And alternate, and done. All right. Good. Put it here. All right. You know the way Masai's put the arungu. Yes. Yeah? <laughs> Place it there. Okay. Seems like you look like you're tired, but you're not. Okay. Okay? So, at times we call them prisoner squats, mm. but for this purpose, we're going to do steam engine squats. You, you have okay? to demonstrate. <laughs> so, steam engine squats, you'll go down, and you come in one. Okay. Go down, come in two. So you make sure you're cranking to the left. Yes. So that you work your obliques. Okay. You ready? Legs yes. out. Yes. And don't lean forward. Three, two, let's go down. One. Two. Three. Four. Make sure that knee is coming towards your elbow. You have 10 more. You have nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ah, oh, that's some incredible score right there. Let's have a seat. Yeah. I told you guys, I care. I care. See, we are sitting. All right, so while we are here, and you like this workout, <laughs> you know what I'm about to do. So angle your stick, all right? So we're working on our lower abs, so we will have our legs move out and out, all right? Yes. I, I thought I, I thought I thought this meant I cared. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Five, four. We start with that side. Okay. Let's just have our legs on one side. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice you see the reason why I love it. I see, I see. It's very effective. Very effective. Okay. Okay. You're still sitting down. Okay. And all this time, you're just lifting those legs, okay? Okay. So you make sure they come up one, 
two. For advanced, you bring them here, two. So heels, don't touch the floor. However, for, for beginners, you can for place beginners, your heels down. I am your beginner, guys. <laughs> okay. I'll show you how to hack this. Sit back. Your stick is in front of you. Three, two, enjoy. Two, three. So if you're my four, beginner, have your legs five, down. Up six, and down. Seven. Up and down. Eight. Or single. Nine. Single. And ten. Single. And single. <laughs> That's a really good workout. All right. We have this stick. I want us to do basic sit-ups, all right? Okay. So but where is your mic? Is your mic behind or on your waist? On uh, your waist? Yeah. All right, you should be good to go. Mine is behind, but no problem. I'll still hack this. Okay. So we go all the way down and then come up and squeeze the head in between your hands. Are we good? Pardon? Pardon? All right, so we're going down and then we come up and squeeze the head in between. Yeah. All right? We're only doing 10 counts. Five, four, position three, two, and go. One, and two, and three, and four, and five. And six. And seven. Okay. Eight. Give me two more. Give me last one. All right. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> no, no, nothing. We are good. good? All, right. All right. We're turning. Yeah. Now you can either use one okay. or you can use your own. Okay, so you place your, your feet down. Place your knees, not feet. You place your knees down, okay? Now we're going to go down slowly. And you pick it. Okay. Ah. Right? Pick the weight. I know you can feel. It. Remember, we said the core goes all the way to the back. So I want you to squeeze. Use this also as a way of stretching. Okay. Okay. Where are our legs? Down. Your legs are down. Okay. Your legs are down. So we are squeezing. Okay. okay? Yeah. Three, two, bring it towards you. Hold. You hold. You hold. <laughs> Hold. Now push it forward. That's one. Come on. Place it down. That's one. Let's go back again. Hold it. Three, two, one. Place it forward. Bring it again. Three, two, one. Place it forward. And again. Three, two, one. Forward. Again. Three, two, and one. Last one. Three, two, and one. Good. All right, fine. Now uh, let's stand up as we wind up and come to the end of our sticks workout. I want us to stretch. So hold your stick, hold it out, hold it forward. <laughs> Breathe. So I want you to twist and hold it. Make sure you're not testing, uh, turning. Sorry. Five, four, three, two, one. Twist and turn. And the other side. Twist and turn. All right. And turn. And give me two more. And turn. And give me last one. And turn. And we'll do one of Andy's warrior <laughs> stretches. Yes. Like he likes to call them. Yes. So we we'll just start from here. We go up. I want us to turn and go all the way down and come back. And then we'll keep alternating for 10 counts as we wander. Five, four, three, two, come up, turn, and lean back, and go forward, and turn. And up, and turn, and the other side. So guys, we're just trying to show you that you can still stretch. Keep moving with whatever equipment it is that you are working with. You don't have to stop using it. You can still use it. And we really appreciate you moving with us every Tuesday. My name is Scoffiness. Find me on Instagram, LinkedIn, or 
anywhere around. My hashtag is hey, hey, keep moving. Andy, where can we find you? Andy underscore Buffy. Okay. Body Justice Fitness on Instagram, Facebook, Body Justice Fitness KE. And that's our last one. We appreciate you guys for moving with us every single Tuesday. See you next Tuesday. Join us every Tuesday. Thank you so much. Utawala Gym and Aerobics. We really appreciate you guys for having us and for allowing us to use your facility. Adios. We are signing out. Till next time. Adios. Yes. Her Royals, Coffiness and Andy. Did you know you could do all of that with just a stick? Did you see how Andy was sweating? So do not underestimate the power of a stick. I hope you've had a great morning. Thank you so much for participating, for choosing us every single morning. We don't take it for granted. I just want to wish you a beautiful, blessed day. I will see you tomorrow. Adios.